so today is Sunday and we still find ourselves in Krakow in Poland we're really enjoying our time in Poland we can't believe that we've been here for over three weeks now yeah. and I think we've still got another week left so we're super excited but today we're not going into the city center of Krakow we're actually going away from Krakow yeah <laughs> what we're doing today is we're actually getting a bus from the city center all the way to the national park and I think the name of it is Oitsovsky we're gonna put yeah. the name here for you guys yeah it's really nice that it's only an hour away and the best part is that today is an environmental day and when we checked the bus tickets it said that it's actually free so we've been riding on two different buses for free basically we're waiting at the bus stop now and in about 30 minutes we should be there yeah Can't wait. see you there guys <laughs> you can clearly see a difference between the city life and the country life feeling so good already the Sun is shining blue skies not one cloud today not one cloud so we are here guys and this is the park it's actually the smallest national park in Poland so it's not that big although it does look quite big doesn't it is it meant to be about 14 kilometers round yeah yeah that's quite manageable then so we're just gonna head into the park here and all the way in here and here we are guys we're already inside the park that only took about 20 minutes on the bus super duper easy so if you ever need to get out from the city center of krakow make sure to come to this national park we just found some mushrooms guys off the side of the track look at this one on its own do you think you can eat those oh, oh, there's oh. A <laughs> animals you can see here yeah red deer wild Whoa. boar badger, badger red fox uh-huh so there's no bears here <laughs> we've already walked 11.1 kilometers today wow but my knees look like giant legs <laughs> what's wrong with my knees and my, and my legs <laughs> they look massive don't they don't Whoa. they Am I that big? No. <laughs> it looks like I'm one of those giants from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> so we're really enjoying our hike so far. I think we've been walking for about an hour already and there's quite a few things going on actually. We've seen plenty of restaurants, a few B&Bs and like mini hotels. There was even a place where we stopped off and bought some ice cream and in that same area there was a few restaurants serving like this smoked fish. It was very very popular. I said to Justina, shall we get some? But then we were like, nah, because the queue was quite big. And to be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of fish, although it did look very nice. Now we're gonna continue walking. I think we'll give it about an hour or so. Um, we haven't got much sunlight left. I think it starts to get darker much earlier these days. Winter is fast approaching, but for now we're chilling under this tree. And I have my beer. Where's my beer, Justina? <laughs> like my servant. But for now we're just drinking our leg beer, just finished off a sandwich and uh, I think that's about it for now. Overall we're really enjoying it. It's actually nice to see some of the leaves changing from green to this kind of orange colour. To be honest I really don't feel like I am that close to the city. It does feel very remote, uh, lots of greenery. It is very nice out here. So if you are in Krakow and you're feeling a bit tired of the crowds definitely come and venture out here you're gonna have a very nice time and let us know if you try the smoked fish because I was very curious to see how it tastes we already walked so many kilometers and we're not even done yet are you enjoying yourself today yeah yeah <laughs> what's you? been your favorite thing uh, just walking just walking yeah, yeah just walking and looking around and um, breathing in a fresh air <laughs> <laughs> look the trees behind you are starting to turn orange can you see yeah just a little bit yeah, so do. autumn's coming justina what's your favorite season summer <laughs> summer really yeah what about spring nah nah summer right, what summer, about the yeah. summer life and winter oh it's snowy <laughs> <laughs> okay so we've discovered that where we want to go 
is probably going to take us about an hour. So instead of pushing ourselves and then having to walk home in the dark, we're going to call it a day and head back into the city and maybe get some dinner. We wanted to go here to see the castle, but we're currently here. Yeah. One way in and kind of either go back or one way out. So yeah. we're thinking just to go out this way and back on the main road and go. Uh -huh. I think it's sensible, I otherwise think it's, for the best. it's gonna be dark and it's just gonna be really, really not worth it, I don't think. Yeah. So there should be a bus here at 6.20. It's now 6.40. We're getting very, very concerned. Guys, it's took a turn. It has taken a deep, dark turn. Well, hopefully not actually. Okay, so we're getting a little bit concerned as the sun is about to set in about 20 minutes. We're at a bus stop where the time says 6.20, but it's already about, what's the time? 6.30. 6.30. It's the last bus into the city centre, and if this bus doesn't come, it's around an hour and 45 minutes to walk to the next bus stop. And then when we get there, we have to wait for an hour. So this could be three hour plus journey to get back to Krakow city and it only took us about no more than an hour to get here. So basically we're quite concerned. We are in a village and uh, yeah, the sun is about to set. Uber is not working. Uber is not working. Um, yeah, the walking time, like I said, is like two hours. We've already done about 14 kilometers today. My feet are aching. Um, I've actually tried hitchhiking. <laughs> Nan, I'm sorry. <laughs> we even went to a hotel um, to try and book a taxi because we thought maybe they can book it. But there's literally a wedding going on. Everyone's dressed in a nice best outfits. Look at me. I felt terrible. I couldn't even get to the reception. I was like, let's go. I feel so bad. So the last, last, last resort, if everything else fails, is to knock on one of these village houses and just say, can you book a taxi? We've got Google Translate going. Um, I don't know at this point. <sighs> don't know. Ready to hitchhike yet? Stick that thumb out. Going on then. <laughs> <laughs> I would say let's wait for another 15 minutes. Whoa. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if the bus doesn't come, then we'll just have to knock on people's doors and uh, ask them to call us a taxi to Krakow. Yeah. yeah. It's like what you meant to do. We saw that there was a bus, it's not here. Yeah. Um, We've got yeah. all the information to say that the bus is supposed to be here at 620. Yeah. Okay. Tina's hitchhiking, she's had enough. No, don't film me. Go on and hitchhike, stick that thumb out. You need to go to the other side. I think it is. It is. <gasps> oh, oh my God. <laughs> yes. Oh. Yeah. When we catch another, we are able to catch another. One. What do we do? What about us? The same with us. Yeah. So we just wait here, or? You can go here, but just for like two hours. I don't understand. It's okay. I don't know what to do. Because we're not, we're not gonna fit here. No. Yeah? Not for the whole journey. And go with I mean. us for like two hours, and then we can catch another. Bus. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, this is crazy. Why is it so bad? Oh, okay, careful, careful, careful. Why is it so bad? Well, is he not happy? Is yeah. he swearing at us now? <laughs> oh my god. He's really so you're not, not going to Krakow? No, as well. we we don't. We we all do the same. But you're supposed to go to Krakow? Yeah. yeah this <gasps> this bus goes to Krakow. Oh, wow. But he's not taking us to Krakow. Mm. Wow. He can't. No, he can't. Not people. like this. He will be fine. It's illegal. Okay, yeah. He will be fine. Yeah. Oh my God. It's insane. No wonder it's late as well. It was supposed to be here 6:20. Everyone's <laughs> coming out like rats. <laughs> Another bus? Is it the same situation or? No. A bit better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you already paid for this. Oh, you have to pay for the for the service? <laughs> the luxury <laughs> service? Wow. Maybe we can see. If my friend paid. Oh. You got a seat, yeah? No, no. <laughs> this is luxury. <laughs> wow. <laughs>
So guys, we made it back. It was so funny. <laughs> it was literally like the most comedic thing I've ever seen in my life. The thing is, I didn't expect this to be so difficult no. for us to get back to Krakow. I feel like we're gonna leave the park and there's gonna be another bus stop somewhere around the corner. Yeah. No, that wasn't the case. <laughs> we got back, we literally crashed mm -hmm. and we were so tired. We eventually walked about 16 kilometers. And uh, yeah, this is why we're filming the outro in the morning. Uh, we're still a bit tired, as you can see. I think my voice is a bit croaky. Mm -hmm. My eyes are like really like bloated, mm -hmm. but we'll get there, guys. We're going actually to film another video today, so we need to wake up. You know what I just remember? That somebody offered me to sit on their lap. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, there was this guy. He was yeah, like, it's like, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Come sit, come sit on my knees. He said knees. Really? <laughs> yeah. That's it. Maybe that just proves that Polish people are really nice. <laughs> but he was Scottish. How do you know? Because I could hear his accent. Oh, I take my he, words he, back. <laughs> no, 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 seriously, Polish people are nice, but I didn't yeah. realise he was Scottish. You could hear the accent. It's like, come sit on my knee. Oh. So, like, I can't do an accent. But surely they would have done this many, many times. Mm -hmm. Like, why don't they have a bigger bus? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You've got all of those people leaving the national park. Mm -hmm. Why don't they have more than one bus yeah. or a bigger bus? Insane. So we're gonna end this video here. In the next video, you should be expecting us to be discovering some salt mines mm. in Velichka. So make sure you come back for that video. But for now, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure you like it, share with your friends, and as always, cheers to freedom. Woo!